Hey everyone, and thanks for logging on to WXYZ.com. I'm 7 First Alert Meteorologist Mike Taylor, and we'll have a lot of weather going on. Once again, a busy weekend ahead. First and foremost, we have some showers moving through right now. The rain's only going to pick up into the overnight, so it's a mixture of the mist and the fog, but then some rain could turn heavy. This will be towards Sunday morning, and then we're going to have some embedded thunderstorms within this. This is as the storm approaches us, we're going to have this set up. Now, going into the overnight hours, the rain will transition into more of a snow shower, or I should say later in the afternoon for Sunday. That's when it's going to transition to snow. But I think the precipitation will not be the problem. It's going to be the winds. So because of that, there's a high wind warning in effect from 7 a.m. Sunday until 4 a.m. Monday. So we can just say, hey, all day Sunday and early Monday morning, winds are going to be very strong, gusting up to 50 miles per hour. And that's why we have this warning in effect because they can gust up to that range where they can damage structures, bring down power lines and trees and things like that. So here's the forecast rundown for you. Uh, showers and storms are going to arrive and they'll stay in effect for tonight into tomorrow morning. High wind warning remains in effect from Sunday morning and through the afternoon and evening. Strongest wind gust, I believe, will be from 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. Even though winds will be picking up outside of that timeline, I believe that's when the most damage, so to speak, will occur, where the wind gusts could be near 60 miles per hour. So for tonight, our overnight temperature is going to be around 43. Then once we get into the day tomorrow, we're going to see temperatures uh, holding steady, or at least trying to hold steady here. Let's go back. 43 degrees for tonight. Not much of a change as we go into uh, tomorrow, which would be your Sunday. Uh, temperatures are going to be at around 43 degrees. We'll climb up to 50 briefly, but it's not going to last long. Here's a look at that seven-day forecast for you. The rest of the week is going to fill and look like February. A few chances of snow. Looks like a better chance of seeing some snow actually hold off until next weekend, but we'll have a disturbance rolling through midweek, but right now it doesn't look like it's going to amount to too much. Thanks for joining us here at WXYZ.com to get your forecast information. Next planned update will be by Hallie for your Sunday morning.